Okay. Okay, Julie. Uh, we're here at the end of your treatment, and we just want to ask you to find out if there's been any improvements, and if there has been for Dylan what they were. Okay. Um, when we first arrived, I would describe Dylan as uh, having high tone, especially in his arms, uh, more so than the legs. The arms were um, impeding him from reaching and grabbing and bringing things to his mouth. And functionally, I would suppose, feeding with a spoon or a bottle and also allowing him to move to his belly and push himself up. So being tight against his body, that was one of the things that, that uh, we saw. So after the month, um, I definitely saw a lot of improvement in the range of motion in his shoulders. It's, um, look at that. He's not even complaining. <laughs> Actually, he would have complained a lot before. So, um, and I've been seeing a lot more grabbing and reaching. Um, his hands are tight when he tries to uh, reach, but, and, and that's improving slowly. I think we'll see more of a change in the upper arms first and then his hands as development goes down to the hands. So I think in the next month we'll see a bit more change with that. So he is grabbing and reaching. He's using more of his last three fingers, which is great. It's at least he's starting to open up and um, stretching and, and doing a lot more things. He's uh, definitely more of an active baby. When he first arrived, he was more passive. Um, as he'd lay, he'd be, you know, as he would, he'd, he'd sit down and that's where he'd stay. And he wouldn't really move a whole lot. He did kick. But now he's um, definitely more of an active baby and wants to explore and do a lot more things. So, very happy. Yeah, and that's a good thing, then. Uh, well, well yes, being an actor. I guess so. Yeah? As soon as that nanny arrives. <laughs> no, that's great. Yeah, he's, uh, he's definitely squirming more and wanting to, and crying. <laughs>